Hello, beautiful people. I am Clarity Bay. Welcome to your reading. In this reading, I am going to find out what messages are hidden from you. And I am going to give you a detailed information on the messages that you need to know. So all you need to do is allow your intuition to draw you to the stone that naturally resonates with you. Uh, this would be one, two, three and four. I want to ask you guys, please click that like and subscribe button. That is how you guys can support my channel. I am here to support you guys and to give you daily and consistent content. So click that like and subscribe button and let's get straight into your reading. Okay, group one. So if you pick the citrine stone, this is a beautiful natural stone. And we're going to find out here, what are the hidden mes messages that are meant for you? So I can clearly see here, group one, that someone is sending you a message letting you know that they wish things could be better. They wish they could have done things better. So if there's someone that is on your mind that you feel um, just left you without a closure or, you know, you feel like they, they could have done a lot better. I can assure you right now uh, that this person wishes that they could do, do something different. They wish it could be different. The relationship between you and them, they wish that it could be different. So let's find out more information. And also group one, you will probably find out information based on your relationship, um, your career, as well as other information here today in today's reading. It was my fault, but I blamed you. So I can clearly see here, group one, that the person that you are thinking about um, wants you to know and although they may not be telling you and letting you know this, uh, that they clearly feel like it was their fault, but they did blame you. Okay. They did that blame shift. They shift the blame on you. Something that they clearly knew it was their um, responsibility. It was totally up to them to make sure that it turned out the way that it turned out. Um, and they, they blamed you for it. Okay. I hide behind material things. So I can clearly see here, group one, um, that this person, they kind of mask who they are oh, with the things that they purchase. And this is the type of person that this, this person puts kind of like a front up on like social media with the things that they purchase, maybe a car, home or whatever, their clothing as well. Some sort of material thing. It doesn't even have to be very expensive or anything like that. Just some sort of material item. They hide behind that item, okay? And this is what is being revealed to you today. So let's get some more information. I left you before you could leave me. So I can clearly see here, group uh, one, that um, your person was totally afraid of being rejected first. And they kind of knew that you weren't going to put up with any BS because your standards are high. You want something better for your life. You want something that is progressive and that will move forward, something that is liberating and something that is mutually um, respectful. So uh, this person, what's hidden in this um, situation, this message that you are meant to receive is that uh, this person left you before you could leave them um, because they are totally afraid of rejection. So let's get more information for you, group one to find out what other hidden messages are for you. Now I can clearly see group one that those hidden messages were specifically regarding your relationship. So let's get more information. Thank you, Spirit. Group one, don't forget to click that like and subscribe button. That is how you guys can support my channel. I do upload daily and consistent content here on my channel. Okay, to help you guys answer any questions that you may have. So I can see here uh, with the five of ones in a reverse uh, group one of that. With the five of ones in reverse, the five of one energy, let me be clear, is 
fire energy. It, okay, it represents fire and creativity. And the five of one um, energy represents like challenges and obstacles as well as sports and I like rivalry. So I can clearly see here that someone is kind of competing with you, but you don't know that they're competing with you. It's very hidden and very subtle. Okay. So with the four of wands, I can see with the four of wands, again, this is fire and creativity energy. Um, I can clearly see that there is some sort of a celebration, something to do with family, you know, and friends. Okay. So someone is, is most likely having some sort of celebration. And, and I believe that they're, I shouldn't be telling you this, but there, there's going to be like a celebration for you, maybe a surprise or something, but please don't say I said it. <laughs> and I'm not sure if it'll be really big or anything like that, but that is the energy that I'm getting. So maybe you guys probably, you could kind of have a hunch about this. Maybe your birthday's coming up or some sort of celebration is coming up for you, but yeah, there's a family celebration coming up. Okay. I can see here with the moon energy group one of that, this energy here, it represents emotions, okay? And this energy also represents um, um, a problem solved. So you may not see this, but there's something that you're going through and it is highlighted in your existence, meaning in your mind and your emotions, but that problem is soon to be solved, okay? So, and, and, and you will definitely be relieved of this situation, okay? In a very peaceful way, in a way that is, and you are encouraged to just trust your intuition and trust the way that you are led regarding this situation because this problem is definitely going to be solved. I can clearly see here with the star energy uh, that there is a lot of guidance, divine guidance for you guys. There's a lot of divine guidance and stars, the stars are shining up on you. There is a lot of renewal, okay? And although you may not see this, there's a lot of renewal, you know, coming into your life as well as miracles happening right now for you and around you. And the spotlight is up on you. Although you may feel like, you know, you're like, in the dark or you metaphorically, or you feel like you're not being noticed, but yes, people are definitely noticing you. And more importantly, um, spirit is noticing you and you are being showered with gifts and blessings. And you're just encouraged to continue your faith and to just have faith and have belief in the things that you actually want. Okay. Even though you can't, you don't see them right now. Just have belief that they're yours. Okay, let's see what else, group one. Thank you, Spirit, for that clarification for group one. Thank you, Spirit. So group one, I can see with sound healing, um, uh, that you guys are in very in need of healing yourself with sound. So some sort of sound therapy would truly help you guys to balance your energy and to balance your chakra as well as raise your vibration so that you can receive the things that you are interested in receiving, whether it be a new relationship as well as financial stability, um, even just inner peace and joy and happiness. And you guys are encouraged. You don't know this, but you guys are encouraged to do more sound healing and you don't necessarily have to purchase a singing bowl. You actually can listen to these things on like Spotify, um, YouTube, and stuff like that, okay? I will also link 
a link to a video channel, a YouTube channel um, that I know about. And I love to go over there and listen. It's actually a new channel. I'll link it below this, um, in the link below this video, you guys. And I'll just put sound healing because I don't rem remember the name. I'll put sound healing music because it's, it's very um, therapeutic. So watch a movie. So you guys are encouraged, group one, to watch a movie, to, to watch something really creative. You don't know this, but something that inspires you, something that uplifts you, something that makes you dream. Like when you were a little kid and you used to sit and watch the movies and you would just feel so good. So you're encouraged to watch something that is uprating, up, uplifting and liberating. So I can clearly see here um, with Sing, um, a group one, you have a talent. You have an incredible singing ability, okay? Although some of you may be singers, but you, you aren't aware that your singing ability is really incredible. And some of you who do not sing professionally, I want to encourage you to start singing because you have a gift to sing, okay? So put yourself out there and express yourself more. Even sing in the shower, sing in your house, sing outside, just sing, sing, sing wherever you go because this is going to help to raise your vibration. So let's get more energy for you, group one. Spirit, thank you for the clarification for group one. Thank you, Spirit. Harmony, and I love that this harmony energy came out right after the sing energy. This is high confirmation. Thank you, Spirit, for this confirmation for group one. This is high confirmation because you guys don't understand that you are in perfect harmony with the universe and that the universe is conspiring in your favor to give you whatever it is that you want, okay? Although you may not see it trust. So with the trust energy, you are encouraged group one to just believe more. Okay. Your faith could be a little stronger. Okay. Which will help to activate the energy that is necessary to give you that fulfillment, that self-fulfillment. It's just trust. So you're meant to trust. You're meant to just go after your dreams and to just Allow yourself to soar with limitless possibilities. Traveling. So I can clearly see here with the traveling energy uh, that comes out for your reading group one that you guys will be traveling uh, very soon, going on a trip, something quite like an adventure. So this will be something fun. The trip will be um, sparked out of um, like creativity and fun and play. So make sure that you guys get your bags ready and get ready to go because you guys are going to be traveling, doing something really cool and really fun. So I can clearly see here with the Master Energy Group 1 that you guys are guided by the Master, the Creator of the Universe. You guys are favored, blessed, okay? Because I can clearly see here that you guys have a beautiful heart, a beautiful spirit where you want the best for yourself and everyone else. So the Creator of the Universe is actually guiding you and there is a master plan of beauty opulence, abundance, and prosperity over your um, life and over the things that you want to do. You are highly favored. You are blessed. Okay. Turning in. So I can clearly see here with the turning, turning in energy, you are blocking out more and more negative energy. You are blocking out the noise, the criticism, the doubts, and the fears. Although this may be hidden from you, you may not feel like you are but you are. Even if you found yourself here to this reading, let me um, assure you, group one, uh, that you are turning out the doubt, the fear, um, the naysayers and stuff like that. And you are turning inward because you clearly understand that your power resonates within. 
laziness. I love this coming out for your reading because this is clear confirmation for the traveling energy. You guys are going on a phenomenal trip. Okay, so get your swimsuits or if, are we going into spring? Yes, in some places it's very warm, but get your clothing together, whatever you want to take. You guys are going to be chill. Okay, so there's obviously some financial abundance for you guys, lots of prosperity. I see more relaxation for you guys. The rebel. So I can see here group one with the rebel energy. You not taking nobody else's mess. Although you may feel as if, you know, you have been like, oh, I'm just answering everyone's call. I'm here, I'm there. But no, you don't understand. You are a rebel. Okay, you are one to do things totally different, extraordinary, you know, you're the type to go against the grain, you know, just to, you know, um, turn within is rebel energy because you are tuning out everyone else. So that is hidden from you. You didn't really know that you are this boss rebel. Okay, so I can clearly see here with the guilt energy here, a group of one with the guilt energy, you are letting go all of that guilt. You have nothing to be guilty for, and that guilt is leaving you. Okay, because you clearly understand, you intuitively understand that you are human and that we all naturally just make mistakes because we are human and there is nothing for you to be guilty of because the creator of the universe is guiding you and you are beautiful and you are perfectly imperfect. Okay, so therefore you are perfect. Okay. And there's nothing. You are free. I can see with the guilt energy here uh, that you are free and there's lots of freedom for you. Lots of abundance, lots of love, lots of prosperity. So let's get more energy here. So I can clearly see here with the source energy here, the source Energy represents the master of the universe as well. I can clearly see here that with this, this represents loss of abundance. This represents the spotlight shining on your entire reading here. So this highlights what I have, the information that I have given you, a uh, group one. As far as you guys are traveling, you are more um, tuned in to who you are. You guys are natural born entertainers and singers, and you guys just have a whole array of gifts and talents, as well as abundance and prosperity. There's also, when we started out the reading, I talked about how there is someone that knows that they shifted the blame onto you. So all of this stuff was hidden from you, but now it is revealed. It is clear. Okay, so group one, I am Clarity Bay. I am here to give you guys daily and consistent content to support you with the answers to the questions that you have. So please click that like and subscribe button. I am sending you guys lots of love and good energy. Hello, group two. You have chose the beautiful turquoise stone, and I am going to get straight into your reading, group two. Group two, click that like and subscribe button. That is how you guys can support my channel. And I want you to know, group two, that what is hidden from you right now is that someone says, I wish I could take back my words, okay? You are not aware of this, group two, but someone said something to you that was very hurtful, and they sincerely wish that they could take back their words. But unfortunately, words cannot be taken back. So we have to watch what we say, even if we do not mean them, you know? So let's find out what else is going on for you in the hidden messages today, group two. Also group two, you may find out some hidden messages about your finances, uh, your relationships, uh, just, messages from spirit, how you maybe could improve who you are. Also, maybe your hidden talents. So let's find out what else is there for you to know. You came closer than anyone. Wow. So I can clearly see here um, a group two. This person wants you to know that they let you in and let you, allowed you to be closer than anyone they have ever allowed to be close 
in their life. Okay, so you don't know how hard it is to let you go. Group two, um, uh, this person <laughs> is really struggling with the idea of letting you go. So let's find out what else. You and I were too young. So I can clearly see group two of uh, that. Um, this person feels that you and this person were too young or either too immature. Maybe it's not the age, but maybe immature when it comes to just a relationship and dealing with a relationship in general. You guys were not ready because every relationship, sometimes, you know, you have to grow even before you get into your first relationship. You have to grow with who you are. But let's get more into your reading. Group two, let's find out more. What else, Spirit, is hidden from group two? So I can see here with the Two of Pentacles energy. This Two of Pentacles energy, it represents Earth, okay? And this is about romantic love, okay, and partnerships, a proposal in marriage. So I can clearly see... Um, a group two, that there is some sort of marriage and a proposal that is coming towards you, okay? So although maybe this previous relationship didn't work out, but a lot of things, and, and most of the times, things work out, things don't work out for our good. Some things have to go in order to allow new things to come into our lives, so with the Ace of Pentacles energy, I can clearly see here, group two, uh, that there, again, this is very strong proposal, marriage energy, as well as relationship and a new baby, okay? So some of you guys may be interested in having a baby or a family, but there's definitely a new relationship um, uh, coming uh, towards you and a new proposal. So with the King of Swords energy here, a uh, group two, I can clearly see bec with that um, uh, this energy represents air and the intellect. So I can clearly see here uh, that there is someone that is an international leader that will be a part of your life, that is coming into your life an international leader, someone that um, do things very strategically. They have a very strategic thought pattern about themselves. The hermit. So with the hermit energy, this is reclusive energy. This is about being alone in order to create. So I can clearly see here with the hermit energy, um, this is a this energy is about you, group two. You are um, going more within to gain more clarity, okay, about yourself. Although you may feel like you are searching more for the truth, although you may feel like, or, or it may seem like you are outward more, but no, the hidden um message is that you are slowly learning to resonate with yourself and to go within for the truth. Um, and it, it's going to help with your um, spiritual evolution and spiritual growth. So I can clearly see here that there's more spiritual growth for you, um, group two. So with the Wheel of Fortune, this is a very good card, group two. So with the Wheel of Fortune energy, I can clearly see here that there is lots of abundance. There's lots of good fortune, you know, turning for you guys. There's a turning point of good fortune, okay, coming um, for you. Um, a lots of a luck, a lots of blessings, okay? There's a turning point where you may have felt like things have been stuck. Things have been a little slow. You know, you felt like things are just, they're not moving the way that you think they should be moving. Um, uh, there is luck and prosperity um, coming towards you. 
with the Wheel of Fortune energy here. So with the Two of Swords energy, this energy, um, with this energy is about air and it's about the intellect. So with the Two of Swords energy, I can clearly see that um, what's hidden from you is that you guys don't realize that it is time right now to make a decision, some sort of decision, okay? And or to compromise with someone regarding something, okay? And it looks like it's a relationship, okay? So with the world energy, a group two, I can clearly see here with the world energy that the world is your oyster and that you will be completing the goals that you started out to complete. This energy also represents a travel. So you guys will be doing some traveling very soon and um, moving around more, getting more things done. Okay, so let's get more energy for you, group two. Let's find out more. Spirit, thank you for the clarification for group two. Group two, please do not forget to click that like and subscribe button. And please leave a comment below. That is how you guys can support my channel. I am here to bring you guys daily and consistent content to support you with any answers to questions that you may have. So with a burning bowl ritual, so I can clearly see here um, that there are some things that you will be letting go. This is lots of letting go energy for you, group two. There are some things that you must let go. So even metaphorically, you guys have to take whatever it is, see, even in her in her hands, the note says to let go, okay? So you guys have to let go of the old in order to um, bring in the new. So with build strength, I can clearly see uh, that there is lots of strength coming from for you guys, to you guys, being supplied to you guys by divine intelligence, okay? Although lately you may not have felt your strongest, but you guys are building strength. You guys are getting stronger because, you know, challenges, they make us stronger. Struggle makes us stronger, okay? So you guys are building strength and you guys are becoming a lot stronger. Beauty. So with this beauty ritual, I can clearly see here that you guys are even becoming even more beautiful, although you may not feel like that. You may not see that, but that is definitely what is taking place right now for you, and, and, and it is hidden from you, but this is something you need to know and to need to be aware about uh, that you guys are beautiful, and you're, even, you're evolving even more. Um, with more beauty, more inner beauty, as well as outer beauty, day to day, okay? So let's get more energy for you, group two. Let's find out more spirit. Thank you for the confirmation for group two. So with playfulness, I can see uh, that there's lots more fun coming for you guys. It may have been, it may have seemed like a little stringent, a little tight, a little serious, you know, around uh, your situation, maybe your house or your energy, but there's lots more playful energy coming your way and experiences. So with the experiencing energy, again, this helps this clarifies this travel energy and the world energy. There's lots more ex for to, there's a lot more for you guys to do and for you guys to experience. So you will be experiencing a lot more. And with the success energy here, I can clearly see group two that there is lots of success for you guys, and that is coming to you guys. Okay, lots of success. Uh, and I can clearly see that you guys are going to be very, very happy about it, very thrilled, because this is a divine process. 
success. This success is coming um, by divine timing and within divine order and as like a gift. Something that you're going to be very proud of yourself about, but lots of success, financial success, as well as, you know, inner um, inner being success and self-fulfillment. So group two, this concludes your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. You guys click that like and subscribe button. Get these likes up, you guys. I truly appreciate you guys allowing me to channel my psychic abilities to assist you guys with the answers to the questions that you have the most, okay? So please click that like and subscribe button. I am sending you guys lots of love and good energy. Hello, group three, and welcome to your reading. Uh, the hidden messages that you guys need to know about, and I am going to get straight into it, you guys, but I do want to ask you guys to please click that like and subscribe button. That is how you guys can support my channel. I am Clarity Bay, and I am here, you guys, and dedicated to using my psychic abilities to bring you guys answers to the questions that you care most about. So I can clearly see here that with this energy group three, um, the, there's a person that is saying that we both know I am not the one for you, okay? This person is clearly letting you know, group three, that they are not the one for you. We both know I am not the one for you. So let's keep going, group three. Let's find out more information regarding this energy. Also, group three, within your reading of hidden messages, I will give you information um, uh, based on your career, your finances, um, obviously your relationships and um, other information, whatever spirit wants you to know today, you will find out. So let's go find out what else for you guys, group three. I look for you everywhere. So I could clearly see here, group three, that the person, this person, <laughs> tries to duplicate you, but it is impossible. They cannot find you anywhere. You are you, you're unique. They know that you're special and that they could never replace you. You're special. They will never find nobody like you. I don't react when people mention you. So with this energy, I can clearly see uh, that this person is trying not to be vulnerable when someone mentions you or your name, they're trying to just not be vulnerable, okay? They're, which is why they don't react, because if they react, they don't know what they'll say, okay? Because they, they I've, with this energy, it's giving me regret. Like this person is very regretful. I am afraid to contact you. So group three, I can clearly see that this person is definitely afraid to reach out because of possibly how you would respond. They're not sure if they'll be rejected or accepted. So they just, they just don't know what to do at this point. So let's get more energy on your reading of hidden messages, group three. Thank you, Spirit, for the confirmation for the um, hidden messages for group three. Thank you so much, Spirit. Wow, this card just didn't want to go anywhere. Six of Swords. So I can clearly see here group three with the Six of Swords energy because the sword energy, it represents the air and it represents our intellect, okay? So with the Six of Swords energy, um, oh, I can see that there is a move and a relocation that is coming up for you, a necessary move and a necessary relocation, okay? The Fool. So with the Fool Energy Group 3, I can clearly see here that... There is a lots of lightheartedness. There's a fresh hope. And you will be taking even more chances 
there are new paths that you will go down with lots of new adventures and new beginnings. Three of Pentacles. So I can clearly see here with the Three of Pentacle energy, the Pentacles representing Earth, okay, and the physical. So I can see here with the Three of Pentacle energies uh, that there's going to be collaboration for you guys, some sort of collaboration and teamwork, you know, that's going to be a part of your life where people are going to help you with something, something to do with some sort of craft. It could be your talent or your abilities. Maybe you guys are songwriters or painters or even, you know, a sculptor, something to do with art, but there's lots of collaboration coming for you, coming to you and for you help. So Knight of Wands. So I can clearly see here group three with the Knight of Wands energy. Um, because the wand represents fire and creativity. So with the Knight of Wands, I can clearly see uh, that there is a free-spirited, okay, highly sensual, <laughs> okay, person that is coming in your direction, okay? Very S-E-X-Y, okay? Did you guys get that spelling? S-E-X-Y person, okay? I'm coming towards you in your direction. Very free-spirited with high energy, okay? So it's probably a good thing about this first person that I don't know if you let go or you're thinking about letting go, but there's definitely some hidden messages here that you don't know about that you need to know about someone else. So I could clearly see here with the Eight of Wands energy because a group three, the Eight of Wands, that represents, again, fire and creativity. Okay, so with the Eight of Wands energy, I can see that these changes are going to take place very fast. The Eight of Wands represents speed, okay? It represents action, and it represents some news, okay? So, so, so some news is going to be coming to you really fast. So with the Five of Swords energy, this sword energy represents air and intellect. And I can clearly see here, uh, group three, that this is, uh, there's going to be an ending to some sort of verbal contact with somebody. It's sort of like abuse where you've been having kind of like a shouting match or disagreement, even a debate of some sort. Uh, that is coming to like an end, like really quick. And you don't see it yet. Like you kind of like could feel it because you know things like that can't carry on for too long. But some sort of abusive situation is coming to an end really quick. So Queen of Cups, so I can clearly see here because the cup energy um, represents water and our emotions. I can see here with the Queen of Cups energy uh, that um, there's more nurturing, um, a more nurturing person coming um, to you um, very soon. And this person will be offering a lot more healing to you and a lot more support. So with the Hierophant energy, a uh, group three, I can clearly see that with the Hierophant energy, I can clearly see group three of that. This represents traditions, you know, and conventionality and stuff like that. But I can truly see uh, that you are going to feel like you are literally on top of the world or in, in charge, totally in charge of your surroundings, your life, and the things that you want and the things that you want to do. You are you totally have a control over it, although you may not see that right now, but you do because the way that you think and the way that you feel will indicate how things literally turn out for you. So let's find out and get more energy regarding your reading. 
Group three. Spirit, thank you for the confirmation for the reading for group three. Let's get more. So receptivity. So with the receptivity energy, I can clearly see that there's lots more abundance, okay? Inspired creation as well coming to you guys, group three. Lots more prosperity and lots more receptivity for you receiving these blessings as well. The creator. So I can clearly see here that the creator of the universe has you covered. The creator is, is you are, you are favored, okay? And the light is shining upon you for you to manifest your dreams and for you to access the things that your heart truly desires, that connection, that beautiful relationship connection, and to walk in your own power and your own strength. Awareness. So I can clearly see here that there's lots more awareness, self-awareness of who you are and the strength and the powerful creator that you are. That is being shown to you and more of that is coming to you. Friendliness. So I can clearly see here that there is a real friendship and a real, a real um, bond between someone that is coming to you and in your life very soon, group three. So let's get more information regarding your reading, group three. Let's get more information. Thank you, Spirit, for the confirmation for group three's reading. You guys, my dog is barking in the back, so please excuse him. So sync with the moon. So I can clearly see here that lots more beauty, lots more uh, emotional stability. You may not see it because you may feel like you've been all over the place just doing everything, but no, there you guys are stable. You, okay, you're balanced. You're in sync with the moon, and the moon represents a nurturing. Okay, it represents nurturing energy. So I can clearly see that there's someone that is here to nurture you and to give you the things uh, that you desire because you are a natural nurturer. So more rest and relaxation. So I can clearly see here that there's more peace and more relaxation coming to you guys. So because you guys will be traveling and you, because you guys are with the person of your dreams, with that person that offers you that peace of mind, that chance to just... Uh, relax and just exhale because life is beautiful now you will definitely be resting more peaceful because your bills are paid and because you don't have to look over your shoulder and be worried anymore so read so i can clearly see here with the read energy um, that you guys are will be able to decipher and to read and and that to read the book of um you guys will be doing more reading and i mean this metaphorically okay this is the energy that i'm getting i mean it metaphorically like you will be able to read situations before you you know get yourself in a situation that ties up your time and drains your energy you will be given the gift to read a situation very clearly first Thank you, Spirit, for that clarification for group three. So meditate. Wow. So I can clearly see here that you guys have meditation, lots of relaxation energy here, lots of receptivity and blessings giving from the divine creator, the divine intelligence, uh, him, her, him and herself because you guys are truly deserving. So you will be at a place where... Again, everything is taken care of for you, and you can beautifully just meditate and just chill, okay? Kind of like Netflix and chill, but 
Instead of looking at something that creeps you out on Netflix, look at something that uplifts your spirit. And metaphorically, that is the world that you're living in. That is the mindset and the consciousness that you're living in. So that's the consciousness you want to live in. That consciousness of prosperity. You don't want to chase prosperity. You want to be prosperity. And I clearly see that that is what is for you. And that is the hidden messages that are coming for you and meant to be revealed to you today. So group three, that concludes your reading. I'm Clarity Bay. You guys, please click that like and subscribe button. I am bringing you guys daily and consistent content to help assist you guys in the with the answers to the questions that you have um, that are most important to you. So click that like and subscribe button. I'm sending you guys lots of love and good energy. Hello, group four. You have chosen the clear quartz crystal, except this is a raw stone, you guys. Naturally raw. This one is polished. So just to show you the difference, this one is raw. Both are beautiful. Both radiate the same energy. But I'm going to get right into you guys reading. I want to ask you guys to please click that like and subscribe button. That will help to support my channel, you guys. I am dedicated to uh, utilizing my psychic abilities and energy challenge gifts to answer the questions that are most important to you. So first off, I can see here with this, I will wait for a sign from you. So with this, the hidden message is there is someone uh, that is waiting for you to contact them, okay? So let's get more energy for your reading. Also, group four, in this hidden message reading, I'm going to give you guys information also on your finances, as well as maybe will you be traveling, other situations like that. So let's just see whatever spirit has in this reading will come up. Okay, thank you so much, spirit, for that clarification for group four. I knew exactly what I was doing. So group four, I can clearly see that um, um, this hidden message um, that's coming for you is the person that you're thinking about and that is on your mind. And they knew exactly what they were doing. Okay. The moves they were making, the things that they were saying, um, they knew how it would affect you. They didn't know how you would respond, but they thought they knew how it would respect you. But in, in other words, they were conscious of what they were doing, just in case you wanted to know. Did they know what they were doing? Yes, they knew what they were doing. I want to be more than friends. And so this person clearly wants to be more than friends. They don't want to just leave their relationship just being a friend. They want to be more than friends. I hope that you can forgive me one day. So group uh, four, this person is seeking your forgiveness. And let me encourage you, group four, to forgive because it is a true statement that forgiveness is for you and not the other person. But it is also true that it does help to heal the other person as well. So please forgive anyone that may have done you wrong, that you may have felt wronged you, because it's, it is it's just good for your energy and your vibration. Okay, so let's keep going and let's get more information about hidden messages for you in this reading. Again, group four, the messages could be anything. They may not all be related to a relationship. They could be. Let's find out. Click that like and subscribe button, you guys, to help support my channel. Page of Pentacles. So I can clearly see here with the Page of Pentacles energy group four of that this is earth energy, okay? This represents the physical realm, all right? So with the page of pentacles energy, this is about a new job, okay? So I can clearly see that there's money coming for, for you. This represents a new job, a raise, and money, okay? Something along those lines, okay? And money new. So I can clearly see that there is some type of financial news as well as physical money and financial uh, gain coming to you, group four. So also with the eight of pentacles energy here, I can clearly see group 
four with the eight of pentacles again being this earth and physical energy eight of pentacles energy um a group of four this is about uh again employment okay enjoying your employment this is about mastering your craft so i can clearly see here uh, that you guys have mastered you guys are mastering your craft all right that you guys enjoy the work that you do so with the sun energy here, a group four, I can clearly see with the sun energy that the spotlight is on you, okay? The spotlight is on you and there's lots of material happiness. There is a joyous outcome for you, group four, okay? There's a joyous outcome for you in the, whatever situation you have been concerned about and you have not gotten any news on. There is a joyous outcome for for you and lots of materials hap uh, happiness as well as success so I can clearly see here group of four with the tower energy here group of four the tower energy represents a change Okay, so there will be an unwanted change, you know, some sort of change that you didn't expect, but it, it is, you know, a lot of times there is a change that causes us to, you know, do something different, to think something different, to go into a different direction. Okay, so I can clearly see here with the Four of Cups energy, this is water energy as well as emotional energy. So I can clearly see here with the water energy and with lots of emotions, okay? This Four of Cups energy represents um, surprise gifts. There's some sort of surprise gift um, uh, that will be taking place for you, okay? The High Priestess. With the High Priestess energy, I see um, for you, group four, uh, that there's some sort of secret that will be uh, revealed, okay? And that you pretty much know about it. It is something that has been into you, in your intuition for a while, something that you have thought about for a while, and you are guided to trust your intuition about that. Okay, so let's find out more information for you, uh, group four. Connect with your ancestors. So I can clearly see here that there's someone that has transitioned to the higher realm of life that is guiding you and supporting you on your journey of more fulfillment, more happiness, okay, more, more prosperity, even greater wealth, you know, and health. So there is someone on the other side, the higher realm of life uh, that is guiding you and supporting you. So with alone time, so I can clearly see with the alone time energy group four um, that there is a lot, you will be more of a recluse. You will have that alone time where you'll be able to kind of like be by yourself to, to reflect and to just chill and to just, you know, refresh and regroup. Make a meal. So with this energy, make a meal. Um, someone, I can see that you will be cooking for someone new, okay? And you will be showing off your cooking skills and your cooking abilities, even if you have not fit, even if you have not felt like cooking recently. Um, but there's someone new that is going to show up uh, that you will be showing off your cooking abilities to. With the intuition energy, again, this represents a something that you already feel deep inside uh, that will be revealed to you um, uh, very soon. So let's get more energy for you. Group four, thank you, Spirit, for the confirmation 
for group four's energy. Thank you, spirit. So with projections, so I can see with the projection energy uh, that someone will be trying to project their energy on to you, okay? And you may already know who this person is, but it is revealed to you that yes, that is what has been going on is a projection of someone's energy on to you. So with integration energy, I can see uh, that you are clearly connected and with the universe, you are balanced. Um, your frequency and your vibration is in a way where you are open to receiving the blessings and the gifts that are meant for you at this time in your life. You are open for, again, I was just going to say all possibilities. There are limitless possibilities for you. They are all around you. You may not see them, but these possibilities are just everywhere. So even sometimes when you have the idea, I should do this, I should do that. Trust me, it may seem too easy or it may seem like maybe, I don't know, maybe I won't make a lot of money doing that. Maybe that's the wrong thing. Trust me, trust your instincts and your intuition and do things that make you feel good. Always remember to follow your bliss. Clinging to the past. So with the clinging to the past energy, I can see here um, that you were not aware of that you were constantly clinging to the past and the past relationships, which were, in a sense, you know, holding you back from moving forward. We cannot move forward if we're always looking back. Just imagine if you're walking down a street, a sidewalk, if you're looking forward and then you turn just for a brief moment to look back for a few seconds, that slows down your pace and your walk. And actually you would have to stop if you turn all the way around to look back. So with this, the hidden uh, message is you have been clinging to the past. Okay. Thank you, Spirit, for the confirmation for group two. Group four. Thank you, Spirit. Group four, please uh, click that like and subscribe button. That will help you guys support my channel. So healing. So I can clearly see that there is... Um, a lot of healing energy for you guys, mind, body, and spirit healing for you guys. And that is so perfect because health is wealth. That is the only way that we could have anything that we truly want in life is with a balance of a healthy mind, body, and spirit. So group four, this concludes your reading. I am Clarity Bay. Thank you guys so much for allowing me to share my gift of psychic ability as well as channeling energy with you guys. And remember, I'm here to upload a daily and consistent content to give you the answers to the questions that you have the most. I'm sending you guys lots of love and good energy.